Yeah, hi friends. So today we are having Saurabh Mukhopadhyay, one of our course and our student at Gate Applied Courses. So uh, he appeared for Gate 2022 and secured 44 rank in this examination. So congratulations, Saurabh. Uh, Thank you, sir. Yeah. Thank so you can you uh, give a brief introduction about yourself? Yes, sir. I am Saurabh Mukhopadhyay and I am currently a fourth year B.Tech student in Jadavpur University, Kolkata, and <clears throat> I appeared to get 2022 and brag rank of AIR 44. I want to join IISC for my research purpose. <laughs> yeah, good, very good. Glad to hear it. Okay, so may I know like when you started your uh, journey, Madhav, when you started your preparations and uh, how much time? So I decided uh, to start my preparation at the end of the last year gate exam, 2021. Yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. I uh, got a very bad rank in that exam. Okay. Mm. okay. So, then from that uh, moment, I decided to uh, go for uh, go for serious preparation okay. and may, may to get a very good uh, rank in GATE. So, so I then think uh, to join GATE applied uh, to make uh, the my preparation very much consistent, uh, consistent and uh, the test series is beautiful in GATE applied. September, August September in that time I have completed my all syllabus in GATE and after that only revision and uh, giving test and analysis of the test is going on or nothing. Yeah, you said like you are giving the test right. So how you have found there and how many marks average average marks you scored there? Uh, so first in subject test which are a menu of twenty marks. Uh, mm -hmm full marks of 20 then uh, i from there i got uh, average of 15 15 mm. type of marks and in the grand test i got out of 100 i got 80 plus average okay. and test, i lowest marks is about uh, 68 66 and in the first mark and in the last mark test it is highest it is 91 <laughs> good very good so i think that might helps you like you know uh, uh, going to the examination center with the full confidence okay okay so might be like you know during uh, in this journey we might uh, did some silly mistakes or like you know uh, uh, handling some msc questions right so how how you are managed to handle them the MS question uh, is very much time taking in, in 2021 gate also there are too much MSQ but in 2022 also there are a lot of MSQ increased in every year so yes. it is a very important uh, for a gate aspirant to handle MSQs properly and so uh, clearing each and every concept uh, uh, in MSQ is more important because there are four options and we have to check the four options to get a two marks or one marks in the MSQ, full marks in MSQ. Otherwise, you, some people will get zero if he cannot choose one correct answer or like yes. that. So, yes. so concept clearing is more important for MSQ. Mm -hmm. Yeah, good, very good. Like, you know, uh, what was your revision strategy, right? How much time you have given for revision? Mm. Sir, my revision strategy was, uh, uh, I have told that I um, have completed my syllabus in between um, August to September, then only I have uh, six or seven iterations of revisions. Uh, it, it may be 10 also. Uh, <laughs> if, uh, the, the iteration of revision, then it, it will uh, proven to be good for the aspirant also. Um, so revision is very, very important in gate. It, it is the only thing consistency of revision properly and yes. analysis of test series okay and clearing doubts regarding the test series these uh, things are really um, needful for the gate mm -hmm. okay okay very good so uh, like you know uh, any hard times during your preparations because it has been a whole journey right you started your preparation after like a yes. last year gate exam how mm -hmm. you manage that uh, there are a few hard times uh, when my uh, mock test marks uh, become uh, low. Okay. Then I feel that sometimes then um, by revising multiple times and clearing if there are some misconception about the subject, then I uh, 
uh, try to clear those properly by studying get applied material by studying some other resources like standard textbooks in each subject and um, various uh, NTPL type videos mm -hmm. and uh, discussing with my friend group mm -hmm. is a very helpful thing for me because my friends are also brilliant and they will maximum okay. guess solve my doubts and if they solve uh, if there is, are some questions which my friends are cannot solve then i go for the uh, mentors and by the token system they will help me as soon as possible mm -hmm. uh, they replied me uh, in um, most in one hour mm -hmm. see that is what right yeah so with uh, with this all efforts and hard work and discussions right today you are uh, achieving your like you know goal and like you know getting the best results as much as you can okay so it has been a very inspirational journey as uh, so okay so definitely it might help some of the aspirants like you know uh, like you know who want to appear for the efforts so like if you are going to suppose like giving any kind of suggestions for them like who want to give the gate examination right so what what kind of suggestions you might give for them First of all, guided study is important for GET because what to study is less important than what not to study because each and every subject, there are a lot of things which are not included in the GET syllabus. Yes. So our mentor can guide you like to crack GET exam. And I will tell again that consistency is the key or nothing like that. Hard work and consistent work, hard work. <laughs> And uh, again, I want to tell that uh, giving test as much test uh, you can give, you will success. In, you will get success in your exam. Okay. Okay. Yes. So what uh, the, uh, what you said is absolutely correct. Right? We need to focus on practice. We need to focus on revision. And before that, yes. uh, we need to complete our. It will reduce course. silly mistakes also. Yes. Yes. So that will definitely improvise our performances. Uh, really, really good, uh, good sessions. Uh, so, uh, like, uh, yes, if you want to give to apply courses. Uh, no, no. Uh, according to me, it's a uh, hundred percent perfect for the uh, student of uh, student uh, and get aspirants. Mm, so, I am no suggestion. <laughs> okay, okay. Yeah. Thank you. Thanks for the support and thanks for the feedback. And uh, so we will continue our efforts and hard work, like you know, to give the best, uh, best and better services from our side. So, so again, congratulations and wishing you all Thank the best you. for your future endeavors. Yeah. Thank you.